We're over here in Rayleigh today, which is nice for us. It's only about two or three miles uh, down the road from where we're based. And we've just finished putting up this 14 foot by eight foot Georgian chalet shed. This one's got uh, half glazed windows and three quarter glazed doors. But if you look at the doors, you'll notice it appears that there's no hinges on there. That's because these doors are fitted with uh, continuous hinges. It's a hinge that runs from top to the bottom of the door, gives a, a nice little seal on it, and uh, it keeps the front looking kind of clean. It's a, it's a pretty unique look. Let's start out on the roof. So up here on the roof, as is normal, we've got uh, two kilo green mineral felt, and you can see it's laid up and over the roof. It's uh, held down at the edges with battens. We do that on the edge of the roof as well. You can see just here, we run battens right away along the edge, gives it a nice clean look. Uh, front and back, the roof's got fascias on it. Um, again on the front we've got frilly fascias or scallop fascias whatever you want to call them they're um that uh gives the it just sort of like takes the sharpness off of the roof at the front so if we go oh if you look at the front of the shed now if that finger's coming into play you see all these along the front here they're concrete fence posts. What we've done here, we've laid down some concrete fence posts, we've leveled them up. They're just under two foot apart for each one. We've leveled them all up and then put down a four inch by two inch uh, pressure treated frame. That's uh, covering the whole of the shed. You can lay shingle under there, all the rest of it. Basically that shed will never ever sit in a puddle. So if we go inside the shed, uh, you can see that it's got a normal so I'm just clearing up some bits of rubbish that we left in here. We don't normally leave rubbish in the shed, so I'll just clear them out. It's got our normal uh, heavy duty framework on it, which is an inch and a half in that direction, two and a half inches in that direction, or if you like, it's 63 millimeters that way, it's 38 millimeters that way. And you can see there, that's the grading stamp. It's on all the upright, well it's not on all the uprights because we buy them in, in, uh, in lengths. Uh, the grading stamp is a C16 uh, graded timber, which is a dry grade. It's the same as what they use as stud work on houses. Now this one being 14 foot long, up in the roof here, you see, there we go, this here, you've got a four by two there, you've got four by two there, you've got another one in the middle there, You've got another one there and you've got another one just here so we've got four by twos running all the way through the uh, roof it goes right the way to the front and it also uh, goes extends beyond the uh, outside of the shed now i'll show you if i leave that pointed up they, be, they extend beyond and they support the roof um the cladding on this one is thicker than a normal cladding uh the only place we're actually going to see the thickness is just here so just here you can see it's a 16 millimeter finished cladding. Normally we use 12 millimeter, but this client wanted the 16 mil, so that's what we've done. Uh, again, it's a fifth grade or better Scandinavian redwood cladding. We use the same on the roof, although the roof is 12 millimeter. It's not 16 mil, but it's the same grade. It's a, a fifth grade or better Scandinavian redwood. I've got a feeling I just said sixth grade. It's not, it's a fifth grade or better Scandinavian redwood. Now I told you about the floor with the four by twos underneath it. Clad over the floor is 18 millimeter thick exterior gray plywood. So this is a very, very strong floor indeed. It's not gonna uh, be going anywhere. The, uh, move that up. The glazing, it's one piece glazing. The glazing bars are just there for effect. Uh, it's one piece glazing and that's two millimeter horticultural glass. Same as on the doors. Uh, there you go. There we go. There's the, uh, there's, oh yeah, look, 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 I like these. Look. There you go, Gorilla Garden Sheds key rings. I just kind of wish. So uh, there you go. That's a 14 foot by 8 foot Georgian chalet with three quarter glazed doors. Um, yeah, job done.